In this video, I'm going to replace the keyboard on my Toshiba laptop. As you can see, I'm missing an enter key. I contemplated just put, uh, removing the enter key from my replacement keyboard and putting it on there, but I was afraid I'd break the key while doing that, so I'll just replace the whole keyboard. To start the procedure, you first need to remove the battery. and remove one Phillips head screw. After you remove that screw, you can remove this trim bezel. It's just held on by the one screw and some clips. You can pry it up with a screwdriver or a pocket knife. And there are four screws that attach the keyboard to the chassis of the computer. After the screws are removed, you need to remove the keyboard from the computer. There are some little tabs here that hold it in place. You need to kind of move the keyboard to one side to get it around the tabs. Do that on both sides. And there is a ribbon cable that connects the keyboard to the computer that we need to remove. The ribbon cable is held to the chassis with a blockable connector. To unlock it, you pull up on this black part, and then you can remove the ribbon cable, and the old keyboard is out. To install the new keyboard, put the ribbon cable into the connector. And once it's in the correct position, you can lock the connector down. and then just push the keyboard back into place and before I go any further I'm going to install the battery and make sure that it works I turned on the computer and we'll do a test run here Looks like it works. F1 for help. Hey, hey. Looks like everything's good. So all we need to do now is um, reinstall the four screws here. My four mounting screws are now installed. So, we can install this trim piece, we'll put on this edge first, and then this side, it should just press into place. And the last step is to remove the battery again because I tested the keyboard and 
install this little screw here. Thanks for watching.